What's up today my fellow Madden soldiers? So yes, themed diamonds are now in the game. They got quite a few of them. They got one for each team. I know some people ain't very excited about them because for their team they might have got someone that they really didn't need. Like a right tackle, left tackle, and so forth. But here, here's the thing though. I know some, for some people it might be a loss, but in the end, i rather them came out with the players that they came out with instead of the ones that are currently in the NFL that you know that we're eventually going to see anyway. So I actually like the fact that they came out with legends or the greats or however it is you guys want to go about calling them. The thing is, is that it's good to have other people in the game to where you we're not usually seeing them in the game or getting them or you know that's not already in the game. Like like they're either currently in the NFL. So I'm cool with that. I'm all right. Like I said, some people ain't happy. But I'm going to go ahead. What we're going to do right now is I'm going to complete the set for the Dallas Cowboys. I think it was at Mal Fernal. I think that's what his name is. So he's a cornerback. And, yeah, that's what we're going to do right now. Look, just so you guys know right now, as I'm completing them, I'm going to um, – I got to do it individually? Oh, man, if I would have known that, I would have I would have just – oh, wow. Yeah, if I would have known this, I would have just added them all before I even started this video. That's crazy. Yeah, I'm going to put him into the set because I'll go ahead and power him up. I got a power pass for him to get his actual other card. But anyways, yeah, just so you guys know, if you guys have a certain team that you want, you might have a lot of these cards already. I bought majority of the elites. I didn't have them yet. So, but a lot of the golds I already had because when I when I had the fantasy packs, I picked a lot of the cowboys. So look at the reason why I'm saying it right now is better to complete the set. That's really what I'm getting into because not only is it cheaper, but you get the power up. If you go into the auction block, I don't know what player you plan on getting. Maybe some players are not that much. But I know this this Malferno went for 50,000 coins for his power up. Maybe because his buddy started, I don't know. But the thing is, is that I was like, you know what? His power up is going for 50,000. His car is going for like 350,000 to 400, 400k. Yeah, and I was like, it's easier to complete the set and just get his power up. And so if you can't complete it right right now like I could, then just buy the pieces little by little and uh, eventually get it. But right now, I wouldn't encourage anyone to actually go buy the cards because to me, it's not a win. But with this, like EA, they, they played it smart. They made sure you completed it so you get your power up and your token and other stuff. So that's the reason why I encourage it. Um, would I be going for the quarterback that they released, which is a 93 Kurt Warner? I don't have nothing bad to say about him. I haven't really looked into his stats. But the thing is, is that I'm cool with the Patrick Mahomes that I got. Until they release a Cowboy or an actual quarterback that I really, really care more about, then I'm cool. Like I said, I only got Patrick Mahomes right now. The only reason I power up because I only got him right now just to play the game with so I could dot people up. He's not great at accuracy, but he's pretty decent. And so, yeah, I picked him up just so I could. I want to go through the hassle of basically always uh him missing the ball whatever the case may be however you want to say it or not getting to the ball to receiver unlike baker mayfield like he was always overthrowing the ball and everything so as soon as a uh, quarterback comes out that i want guarantee you patrick mahomes will be sold and i will pick him up that's how that's gonna go but like, i got picked the patrick mahomes because I, I doubt that he's ever gonna lose his value like that it'll probably be a while until he does but if he does oh wow he's been doing great for me but yeah, so that's why I got Patrick Mahomes. A lot of people are probably going to keep their Patrick Mahomes. But yeah, I'm just waiting for a good quarterback in order to we call it. But here it is. Mal, oh, Weferno, how's that how you say it? I've seen his name wrong the whole time. Mal, Ref, oh, I can't even pronounce his name. Refno, whatever. There it is. Times three, Cowboys. That would be cool if it came with an X Factor already on it, you know? So, but it, it doesn't. Let's see how much it's going to cost to power them up. Because if I have all the training right here, I'm going to do it. I got quite a bit. 11. What? Damn, I don't even have enough training just for that one. And then put his card in? Okay. So, I'm not going to be able to power them up right now. Wow. What goes for what? Yeah, that's insane. So what I'm gonna do right now, I'm not gonna power them up right now. Once once I do get the, once I do get the training, I'll power them up. But right now, I'm not gonna go and waste my coins because I gotta make a right decision when it comes to actually investing into it. 
Yeah, but I will put them into the lineup for now. And then we will check out how everything's looking. Okay, so he's gonna be, of course, my number one. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put Byron Jones as my fourth. Okay, Byron Jones is right here. I'm gonna put Jalen Ramsey in the slot. Byron Jones should be my fourth. Okay, he's not, but I'm going to make him. And I'll keep Marshawn Lattimore as the fifth, just because on certain plays I can put him in. It's always good to have all, all the corner, cornerbacks you need. You can put in any position whenever, whenever you want. All right. And put Marshawn Lattimore right here. All right, he got 87 speed, too, that Marshawn Lattimore. He's a goon. Just just know that all these cornerbacks they will be using the game somehow, some way. I always interchange them, so it's it, it works out for me. So what we do right now, we're just gonna go ahead and just put balance. I'm gonna put I'm not gonna oh he, yeah I'm not gonna put an X back on him right now. I'm just gonna put balance D on him. Something simple, nothing crazy. And then I probably work on putting lock down a lot of my players. That's what I should do with the training. That's what I got enough for right now. But anyways, yeah, look at he got 89 jumping, 87 play working. His press is not all that, but everything else is decent. 87 man, I mean 86 man, 87 zone, 87 acceleration. So in comparison to Jaden Ramsey, he's better. Darius Slay is better. Byron Jones is better. So he's better than everyone, of course. But let's just see how he plays now. That's really what it comes down to. Want to see how he plays? I will eventually do a gameplay with him. But yeah, what it comes down to is how he's gonna play in the game. If he's a goon, I'll let you guys know. And yeah, look at this is how I was looking right now. This is my team. I got an 87. There will be more players added. I haven't decided who else I'm gonna pick up. This Deacon Jones is a goon. So they have the right end. I want Dwight Freeney. I don't know if I'm gonna get him, but I do want him just for the fact of he's someone different that I never use. His card is pretty decent. But this Deacon Jones plays like a goon. Like I really don't need to pick up Dwight Freeney. So he's another right end, but they got a lot of different players. I will see who my who I might want, who I might pick up, and then uh, I'll update you guys and let you guys know who I picked up. But anyways, my team's at 87 now. I think it was 87 last time. The only reason it was at 86 was because I took out I took out one of my wide receivers or whatever, and I interchanged him with someone else. I think I took the Michael Thomas out. And I put this guy Tyreek Hill right here, so it went down to 86. But anyways, now it's 87. Regardless, I'm good to go. And we'll see how it functions. So I should be 87 straight across. Yes, I am. So everything's looking good. What? Harrison Smith is a 91. Whoa, whoa, whoa. he was an 89. He went to a 91? He didn't go to a 91, did he? Is that a glitch? Hold on. Before I end this, I want to I wanna see this. Nah, he's still at 89, but that's crazy how it shows a 91 with their huh? Maybe, maybe he may. Is he, is he really that glitchy though in the game? Is that why they're doing that? It's good with me if he's that glitchy but anyways that's who it is i completed the mal ref no i can't even pronounce his name i'm gonna destroy his name so i'm not gonna i'm not even gonna try to pronounce it i thought it was ferno so i don't missed up from the beginning but anyways i completed this set i'm happy to get him it actually cost cost me less to complete the set than, than it would to buy him or get his power up so let me guys let me let me know if you guys are gonna get a, a theme diamond or yeah, let me know if you guys can get a theme diamond. Which ones you are, or if you can't get them right now, which one do you want? How you're gonna, and uh, how you're gonna go about getting them? Just put it in the comment section. But anyways, I'm gonna end it right here. If you guys like what you seen, like the video. If you guys subscribe, subscribe to the channel. And if you guys didn't subscribe to Madden Showdowns, go ahead and go over there and subscribe. If you guys like what you see over there, I will be leaving the link in the comment section pinned to the top. I am I am trying to put it out there for everyone to know so you guys can submit your plays and eventually get a chance to be put on there. Like I said. There is a lot of plays that I got, so eventually I'll get around to putting out, um, any plays that you guys submit. I don't mind it or putting something together. It does take time, but like I said, though, if you don't see your play right away, for some reason you submit it, eventually it will be up there. Like I said, I pay attention to everything. So go ahead and go check out Madden Showdown. Subscribe to it, and just know that eventually your stuff will be put up there. And thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm going to leave it right here. I'm out.